Hey guys, this is Mario Mirino from Oxlane.com once again. I'm sorry, but I've been uh, quite busy this weekend, so I, I didn't put any videos, new videos on, but uh, I'm back. Uh, I just want to do a short video about the, the, the announcements that are going to happen in in August 24th, I'm not sure, I think that is the date and give a few predictions, uh, I don't know, things that I, I believe they will do, they will announce for Magic in 2022, yeah, the next year, 2022 uh, so let's start with the, the, the basics, I, I believe that they are doing all this gathering of information the 24th because we got two new sets in uh, already this year so this is new because there's normally it's just one in the uh, the autumn set they, they call it but we're gonna have two one in the autumn another in the winter and this is they will have probably uh, a secret, a secret layer to both of those sets. So this is, uh, I believe that everyone is expecting that, so that's not news, but I'm pretty sure there's gonna have a secret layer about it. The, the, the thing that is intriguing me is that you have the, the delay of the jumpstart historic modern commander, whatever, I, I, I don't know the name of the, the, the arena only so we're probably gonna have they were doing a research about the if people wanted some some cards of the, the, the only arena mechanics to be released in paper so I, I don't think they're gonna be released together with this new secret layer but they're gonna announce it the, those cards are gonna be released only on secret layer this, those guys are not gonna have a, a set on it so they're gonna be on secret layer this is the, 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 the worst thing they can do but they're gonna do it they're gonna be exclusive secret layer cards if they don't announce it this is something that is coming for 2022 2022 is gonna be the year of the secret layer with crazy stuff because we got the universes beyond is for the next year we already know the lord of the rings and the other is warhammer i'm not familiarized with this one it's a game that, uh, that i know but that, that i heard of but um i have no idea about it so you're gonna have some new information about the universes beyond maybe some rick and morty stuff or i don't know any crazy things for secret layer we're probably gonna have a lot of commander this is the new magic the gathering commander is the, the thing so this is the most pessimistic thing that i can say to you guys because you know my position about commander i think that is fun but the game is not Commander, the game is Magic the Gathering. Commander is uh, something created by some players, they need to use cards that are released for Magic the Gathering competitive, for standard. Cards should be on standard, not on Commander. The best reprints and prints have been, doing, uh, have been done in Commander now. When you got a good set, this set is not standard, it's Modern Horizon by the double of the price. So. I believe that I, I'm not sure if we're gonna have uh, Modern Horizons again, but we're gonna have something familiar, uh, quite like Modern Horizons. We're gonna have I, I, I'm not sure yet. Maybe another jump start. If this, there's not a secret layer with the the new mechanics, maybe the jump start story will be the tabletop one next year. But I I, I believe this, those cards are gonna be on secret layer. They prefer to sell directly to the. the, the to the people so stores can can go around those cards and i believe this is a good thing 
for as as part of Magic the Gathering. I believe the specific cards, promo cards, should be sell directly from Wizards of the Coast. Stores shouldn't have the the access to those cards. They need to buy from other players. Do the, the, the to make people to start doing what Magic is, is all about: trading cards. So a store gets those unique cards only by trading or buying from other players, not getting from boxes they are, they are open. I, I do, really do believe that. Uh, although I believe that Magic has been drowning on those products because everybody wants Commander car, a Commander because the, the best reprints are there. So prints and reprints. So I believe that most stores aren't open so much boxes. Here in Brazil, they're still opening because the market is way different from the US. But most stores are getting away, I believe, you know, around the world. Maybe this will affect Brazilian stores. There's a lot that are closed because of the pandemic that they have been closed. So a lot of that are already coming back. Uh, Moxland is still holding the the, uh, the storage is not open, but we are still shipping. Yeah, we're gonna wait uh, as most as we can to reopen for the public, because you have people playing inside of the store. It's not. It's I I it's, it's something that I do not uh, agree with the idea right now because of the pandemic. But I'm gonna be sideways here. Uh, Another prediction for the next year. This is probably Commander Plan Chase. They were doing uh, research about it too, to, with the, the public. And I, I believe this is gonna have like Commander 2022, gonna have Commander Plan Chase, gonna have every set with a couple of, maybe four Commander decks, because this is what we get now. And a lot of secret layer. I, I do believe that the secret. They, they're gonna do the announcement in 24 of August. We're probably gonna have a huge secret layer right now. And this is, I, 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 I do believe this is really sad. This is, this is the worst that can happen that can happen to Magic the Gathering is happening right now. The, the, re the last research was asking about it. Well, what do you think that magic is going up or down or established? I believe that it's going down. I, I, I did answer the, 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 the quiz. And I didn't agree with most of the, 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 the things they are, the, 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 uh, those are affirmations they were doing. I, I do like Magic Arena a lot. I believe this is the best product they have right now because tabletop is commander. So, and they are trying to ruin Arena too because they are doing a specific cards just for Arena. And this is, it's not that they are ruining Arena, but it's, it's getting way too far from tabletop magic. And I believe the, the, there are a lot of people who complain about it and they this is the reason they're gonna have a product that are gonna bring those mechanics to to tabletop because this will would be a, a huge issue for, for everyone and I, believe, I I don't remember if I have any other prediction I did this video just to to do a video today because it has been a long time but I believe those are the predictions there isn't much going on that is really good. The set's probably gonna be awful, all of them, in stride again, two in stride. Ah, the other prediction, just for another one. I believe they're gonna really, if they're really gonna do the Kamigawa, new one, new Kamigawa, new something. If this is the idea, I believe this is gonna be great as an idea, as a set that needs a, 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 being seen again. But way better than it was at first because the the, the, the three Kamigawas are awful. They they were, were terrible, but they suffered because of the the game was was monopolized by affinity and everybody was going the, uh, going away from Magic at that period. But I believe if they are going to do that, this is going to be a great idea. But they need to put good cards on the set. 
for the love of God, put some good cards there. Ooh, we can get GT or not as a top a box topper. Enough of box toppers. Put some good cards in that in the set because you you get you can have a box topper like Liliana and Eternal Witness. The one that people got is Eternal Witness because the, the most common to come. The the good one never never shows up in the box. So we need to open a lot of boxes to 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 have access to for for those those good cards. So please put the good cards in. It, it, I, I said Jitter, but you don't need Jitter. Jitter is a banned card. It's, it's, it's probably a, a not a good idea to have Jitter in, in, a, in, a, in a standard. But we need a lot of good cards now, man. It's because if we, without that standard and all the other competitive magic is gonna go away. We're gonna only we're gonna have only commander and. This is I I I'm I'm on this crusade against Commander. It's not that I don't like Commander, but some someone needs to step up. And as a store owner and a, a long a long time in Magic since '97, uh, I, I I've seen a lot. And every time the Magic was at its peak, when it was the format we had the best cards ever since Urza. Urza was great standard, even though we got better cards in standard. But it was the best cards in the game ever. And we got a lot of like, we had Mirrodin was a cool set. The affinity was a problem, but we had like the first time Spiral, not this, this uh, scam they, they did where you get nothing from this box. This <laughs> awful box to open. Just the Hetero cards were valuable or some Mythics, but not all of them. So, so the cards are going down because of that. And we need to, we need better, we need better cards. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you can give it a like, I, I would enjoy that. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, subscribe if you can. Uh, we'll try to do more videos. If you didn't like it, go there and dislike it because it's some way that, it's a way that I can get the feedback of people with the, the the subject or opinions that goes different from mine, there's no problem. I'm open to hear all of them. You can comment. And thank you again for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I see you soon. Bye.